Sai Ram. My humble pranams to the lot of beat of Bhagawan Satya Sai Baba. Yemai purdum, yennanjil, ningamal, yennayekum, Bhagawan Satya Sai Baba on purpada kamalangaluk yennai arpani kiren, arpani tu kroge. Sai Ram, Sai Ram, Sai Ram. Karpaga Vinayagar Temple is a famous temple in Tamil Nadu. I was born on Vinayaka Chaturthi. So that is the reason my parents named me as a Karpaka Vinayagam. But unfortunately, I was a non-believer. Thinking that I am very intelligent, we can do anything and all. God's help is not necessary. I became a lawyer. One shared is I devotee came and interested a case to me. I got the orders. Without knowing that orders obtained only because of God's grace. He was very happy. He took me to... Sherdi Sai Temple in Chennai. There is a called Mailapur. There is a Sherdi Sai Temple. I was there and uh, there is a chanting mandra, something. I was not impressed. I don't know anything about it. Because of the fact that uh, I got an order for him, that Sherdi Sai devotee, he is one of the organizers. He uh, chanting mandras, other things and all. He showed the school, all these things and all. I was not impressed. But anyway, it's all one of the gods. Then I came to Delhi from Chennai for conducting a case by engaging a senior lawyer. We got the orders from Supreme Court. From that, I just I came to came back to Chennai. That was a six six thirty flight. I came thirty five thousand feet. It goes. I was very happy. First time travel. I was taking the food. Suddenly it's jerk. It thirty five becomes thirty. Thirty. Becomes 25, 25, 20. I felt, yes, I am going to die. Without doing anything, without earning anything for my family, my son, my daughter, my wife, I felt it. The only God, it was introduced to me at Shirdi Sai Baba. So I begin to pray, Baba. Baba, Baba, save me, save me for the sake of my family. It was at that time 10,000 feet. I am going to die. I know that. Suddenly, I got a figure near cockpit. I got the figure, not Shirdi Sai Baba, Satya Sai Baba, full of hair. Then Abhayasam. I was uh, thinking, I called that man, this man has come without summons. Then I saw, immediately uh, raising the hand, Abhayasam. I felt uh, exhilarated. I got energized on seeing the figure. 10 becomes 15. 15 becomes 20, 20 becomes 25, 25 becomes 35. It goes. It's a miracle. Then the flight uh, landed in Hyderabad instead of Chennai because there is a jerk and other things and all. Then pilot uh, came out and saying after landing in Hyderabad, Sir, we had a miraculous escape. Only because of the God's grace, we have escaped. At that time, I begin to love Swami. Then I came to Chennai and uh, Every Thursday, I used to go to the Sundaram, Chennai Sundaram Temple. I became a real real devotee. And uh, in fact, uh, I told uh, my friend, because my friend's father is a a Sai organization, one of the organizers. Sir, I want to see Swami. I want to get an appointment with Swami. I told him, Venkatraman. Venkatraman's son advocate, Ramasubramaniam. I requested Ramasubramaniam. Then I was taken to Venkatraman. Venkatraman said, Swami comes to Kodaikanal. Please come. I went there. First day, Swami from uh, her uh, residence, he comes down. Just goes down and walking away. He does, He did not come near to me. I came here to meet Swami. Swami doesn't come to me. Second round. Second round. When second round, he comes to, directly to me. Because I was praying. Then Venkatraman says, Sir, don't uh, touch his feet. Padanam's karam. Unless he, he allows you to put, don't put. When I said and all, he was standing near to me. When he said, uh, don't do that, immediately I got an inclination to do that. Then I jumped on over his foot. I was able to touch the, uh, the foot of the Swami. I was uh, taken to heaven, I felt. He also did not remove his uh, foot and all. I also did not. Then after five minutes, Swami says, Santosham, Santosham. I got attached. I got completely immersed with this. 
the miracle is not end does doesn't end there i came to chennai i got a photograph when swami bless me somebody took photograph and then photograph sent from that day, time onwards i became sai devotee then i started a advocate sai study circle in uh, probably 1995 every month there is a bhaj- bhajan function in advocate house prasadam bhojan speakers all this this i started this the function started in, uh, in my house first first function started in my house terrace within 6 months i got a news that i may be tipped for judgeship in fact I, somebody told me sir read uh, sai sat charitam for 7 days your prayers will be healed i began to study in bhuja room sai sat charitam seventh day i received a call from a chief justice of madras high court swami karnataka man then i thought uh, what is it uh, i thought i will become a senior counsel i went to chief justice's room he says sir some of the judges uh, suggested your name to become a judge of high court what do you say i thought sir i am just uh, practicing nowadays Uh, so i am reluctant to become a judge and all otherwise uh, income will reduce no no why you are reluctant no no i want to get a permission from swami sathi sahib no no tell him that i have suggested i am the shirdi sai devotee you tell your swami sathi sai swami that time then immediately but don't tell any others about your proposal law then i went there i gave a concern after getting permission after getting the 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 concern from the swamis i gave the concern within 6 weeks i became the judge of high court from that day onwards all the judgments and all most of the judgments i used to refer to the some sayings of bhagwan as a matter of fact when i took oath on ceremony on first day in madras high court i said after uh, giving oath and all i used to address a meeting i written speech and all i have begun to switch what i am today because of swami 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 without the grace of swami i am nothing then i said it it is recorded in the high court records and all i became the judge of madras high court january 96 i got a appointment order before taking oath i went to puttaparthi i was sitting in the meantime there is a um, ia study circle is there so they invited me to give a talk i gave a talk to them how a flight accident and all i became the swami deity then ias officer asked her, sir why don't you start a advocate sai study circle <laughs> that is how i started now even now is going on 196 month and all there because uh, on behalf of study study circle we we gave a service to the poor people and flood flooded time and all we give the help food cloths all these things these are service activities not only bhajan not only bhojan but service that is being done and all even now in chennai they are doing this every month during the course of the appointment i am going to take oath that is on 8th january 96 before that i got a appointment order i went to puttaparthi got it a blessings of bhagwan i was first row but bhagwan come and not uh, stood before me just going suddenly i stood up when i stood up and all bhagwan came to me bahunava he said yes my lord yes swami swami by you swami's grace i am going to be appointed as a judge of high court this appointment order please bless me oh bahu sandosham bahu sandosham i will be always with you i bless you then with that i come to chennai high court first speech is what i am today because of swami 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 from that day on so many judgments i have given so many judgments and all with uh, swami's grace no judgments of mine has been set aside by the supreme court all confirmed and uh, people used to say uh, any problem between the husband wife and all i used to say go to puttaparthi get the blessings of come they go to puttaparthi 
and saw swam swami and came and compromise matter is dispute is over instead of uh, i decide the matter i uh, requested uh, bhagavan to resolve the matter and problem solved so many times i was uh, a judge in madras high court but uh, i was not able to become a chief justice of high court some high court but subsequently i got the instead of becoming chief justice i became the chairperson of appellate tribunal electricity equal to supreme court judge i became the chief justice and from there i came to delhi i became the chairperson of appellate tribunal electricity then i came to puttaparthi along with my daughter earlier i came with the daughter she was advised satya my daughter's name satya satya you will get a good mapalai good bride groom see that a good man will come like that uh, a good uh, maple has come is a good man after a marriage after th- 3 years and all we came to puttaparthi we got a interview two things he told we will get a very high position in delhi wait for that you will rule you will rule he indicating that he will he will he, 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 i will go to top position in india wait position will come satya Oh, you have come before marriage. You have promised me, Swami, promised me to give a diamond ring to me after marriage. Now, our marriage is there, and I have come with my uh, husband. Please give a diamond ring. My Satya says, Satya, you are not for a diamond ring. You are for a child. Three years over, no child, so you have come. Is it correct? Yes, Swami. Then sing a song. the song was sung by him by my daughter he was just correcting it this 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 is this must be sung in this way thereafter swami was very happy swami asked satya you bring that bunch bring that bunch bunch is there a uh, bunch is taken and vibhuti uh, bunch taken and give it to the swami says satya come extend your hand take come take two bunches given because we are also trying our best to get a pregnant when we go to the doctors chennai doctors or the doctor koyam the doctors and all nothing but uh, two bunches of uh, vibhuti was uh, given satya think of god always think of me i given two bunch you will get a boy son don't worry then came we didn't of course know the point without uh, sub she is become pregnant within two weeks after uh, some months and all say it is found to be twins both are boys <laughs> and uh, in fact uh, one boy name is kartikeyan another boy name is kirti vasan because this uh, he said after boys uh, were born and all you bring to me i will put a name but uh, after martani mahasamadhi only we were able to take a to puttaparthi and uh, some priest put a name is a kartik again kirti vasan the same miracle now this point that boys are studying in 9th standard memory power such a memory power i used to ask them what is abc the boy says abc always be cheerful always be careful always be calm always be courteous always be creative always be constructive always um, compassionate always be composed always be charitable always avoid bad company he will say like that sal babas message and all such a both the boys kartike and keerthi wasan very bright boys they i could see moment baba baba photo comes and all he will come and prostrated such a people um, they are very happy my satya daughter and son sir of coimbatore her husband is kadir uh, kadiravan is all bhagwan's grace everything bhagwan's grace what time today because of bhagavan's grace only everything is a miracle in my, in my life i was able to give a lot of judgments madras high court and uh, ranchi chief justice court and also aptel judge and all lot of judgments i am able to give only because of the grace of bhagavan we win the race only when we get the grace of bhagavan that is faith shraddha sabhuri solvanga you get faith 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 i was not able to finish my school final i want to commit suicide before committing suicide i went to a library a book was given book read it i decided not to commit suicide that book is called my experiments truths these uh, 
experiment the truth gave me the determination. That is the reason, determination. So, what is life is a challenge, face it. Life is a crisis, manage it. Life is a game, play it. Life is a song, sing it. Life is a lesson, learn it. Life is a law, follow it. Life is a love, enjoy it. He taught love, how to love. Well, you love one thing. I love myself, but more than myself, I love my wife. I love my wife. More than my wife, I love my family. I love my family. More than my family, I love my community. I love my community. More than my community, I love my country. More than my country, I love whole humanity. Vashuteva Kudumbakam. That is more important. Bhagavan says, yesterday is a waste paper. Today is a newspaper. Tomorrow is a question paper. What is the answer paper? No difficulty. It's your life. How to handle the matters? How to solve the problems? It's your life. First... Life is a note. First page is already written. Birth. Last page, also already written. Death. Middle pages are empty. You have to fill up. It's your, it's your, it's your effort. It's your effort. Life without integrity. What is the use? Integrity without industry. What is the use? Industry without aim. What is the use? Aim without effort. What is the use? Effort without pursuit. What is the use? Pursuit without perseverance. What is the use? Perseverance without purity. What is the use? Purity without commitment. What is the use? Commitment without devotion. What is the use? Devotion without dedication. What is the use? Dedication without determination. What is the use? Determination without discrimination. What is the use? And discrimination without discipline. What is the use? These are all the things and all you have to follow. Yep, Swami's message. Swami's message is not a something, jugglery of words. Swami gave ten commandments. I, single letter, avoid it. V, double letters, use it. Ego, three letters, kill it. Love, four letters, value it. Smile, five letters, keep it. Rumor, six letters, ignore it. Success, seven letters, achieve it. Jealousy, eight letters, distance it. Knowledge, nine letters, acquire it. And uh, discipline, ten letters, maintain it. Such a great things and all, every word, every word. He says job, what is job? Joyful obligation is job. Do it joyfully. Enjoyfully. Whatever the work and all given to you, it's a Bhagavan Prasadam. Do it. You know the word discipline. It conveys a message. Discipline has got ten letters. Alphabet of D, 4. I, 9. S, 19. C, 3. I, 9. P, 16. L, 12. I, 9. N, 14. E, 5. Have the total? 100. If only you are disciplined, manasekam, vachasekam, karmanyekam, mahatpanam. You must have a purity in the thought, purity in the words, purity in the deeds, actions. You will become a pure man, you will become a mahatma. That is the reason we are in the world. The world is full of so many problems that you have to overcome the difficulties, you have to come up. You must have a knowledge, knowledge without wisdom, scholarship without determination, Music without melody, learning without humility, speech without truth, friendship without gratitude, society without discipline, worthless, meaningless, tasteless. So you must have a purpose in life. Everybody has born for a particular purpose. Apple purpose, trees purpose, cow purpose. Cow yield milks, not for themselves, to help others. River provide waters to help others. Trees bear fruits to help others. Itam paropakaram sariram. That is a real education. Siksha jivan ke liye. Jivan prem ke liye. Prem manav ke liye. Manav samaj ke liye. Samaj sanshar ke liye. Sanshar shant ke liye. Om shanti shanti. I am so inspired. 
about our duty to motivate the youngsters we go to temple abhishekam all these things and all we go to puttaprati we go to shirdi that is not enough you follow the teachings try to follow the teaching efforts may fail but never fail to make efforts our life is full of efforts do something and all when i was a lawyer i had to say something on one 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 case where i could get a very good orders because of uh, my frankness and my fairness to the judges husband wife husband tortured wife one day husband poured kerosene over her and set fire went away she cried then both uh, father and mother in law came and uh, took her to the hospital and uh, admitted uh, 90% of the burn injuries then father and mother came unless you give a complaint against him your husband i will not take you back to my house father and mother then police came magistrates also came gave a dying declaration saying that my husband only poured kerosene arrested trial court convicted him and sentenced to undergo for 10 years matter comes to high court just i was a prosecutor in initially assistant prosecutor i resigned my post i became a lawyer i began practice the people came and uh, approached me sir i interest the case 10 years please uh, argue the case any amount of fees i will give it wait fees secondary i will go through the matters and i will try to take a point try to find out some points then points and all i could i could go through the entire matters i told uh, the husband mr this is not case for acquittal but i will argue for sentence for 10 years i will try to make your sentence reduced but provided you must do one thing what is it how many how much of property you have got 50 acres sir you can settle 25 acres in favor of wife will you do it sir definitely i will do it sir then matter came up i told the judge my lord this is not for matter for acquittal we are in the world of justification because any mistakes and all he won't admit it's a new style sir if a teacher makes a mistake he says new lesson sir if a lawyer makes a doctor says makes a mistake new diagnosis if a lawyer makes a mistake new interpretation of law if a judge makes a mistake it's not a mistake it's a new law so such a uh, such a world of uh, duplicates we are pretending as if we are originals but duplicates i showed a judge to show my fair conduct this is not a case for acquittal i will see that uh, some matter settled judge was very happy over my conduct then gave time this time after a week both husband wife come both came sir save my husband because i have joined with him save my husband uh, no ma in fact i have told uh, for case for uh, conviction but thing is reduce sentence and all then we argued the matter judge was listening carefully mr karpagavan i am you read the entire thing and all read the thing and all first case is a uh, uh, statement before the doctor second case uh, statement before the magistrate and statement before the court these are all very important right? this is a case for clear conviction only thing is for the purpose of settlement both have joined the sentence may be reduced i was confident that uh, judge is very happy with me judge is going to um, reduce sentence now more than husband wife insists me sir are you for acquittal are you for acquittal then matter was posted for judgment i have finished the matter on thursday usually i used to post the matter in such a way it comes on thursday <laughs> because the guru or the monday it was posted for judgment first matter judge called husband your 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 counsel argued very well he argued for question of sentence but i am not able to accept that but whatever it is don't hereafter cause any harm to your wife treat your wife very well yes so i am not accepting question of sentence but i am acquitting the accused acquittal i was i was <laughs> shocked i was surprised acquittal has come i felt only because of fair conduct judge helped me acquittal i thought it sometimes uh, ego oh we got because of our fair conduct because of fair uh, the thorough thoroughness and all judges acquitting i thought i was very happy i felt i was acquitted then evening they came both of them came big mala and uh, palam fruits and a cover cover containing currency notes 
Mr. I have already received the fees. I take garland, I take fruits. They are very happy, they went out. I also very happy. Then within 15 minutes, she, she came back. What, madam? You have already joined with the husband, now you are coming back individually, separately. No, sir, I want to tell the truth, sir. She says, what truth? I thought that uh, because of my fair conduct and all, I was able to get an acquittal and things. Then she says, sir, my husband did not pour kerosene over me. It's a new fact. Why? No, no, usually my father from the village sent the Pongal Siri Versailles. Articles, functions, articles. That Siri Virasai was brought by not uh, decent people. We are we belong to the higher caste. My husband got angry and abused my father like anything. I was not able to bear that. He went out. Then I went to the bathroom, took a kerosene bottle and poured myself and set fire to. In the meantime, my father-in-law and uh, mother-in-law came and uh, rescued and took me to hospital. I was asked to say to the doctor that is sobest. I said it. But my father and mother and came because of the act of my husband. I says, unless you give a complaint against your husband, we will not take you because 80 percent of burn injuries. So on the compulsion of my father and mother, I gave a complaint to the magistrate stating my husband poured kerosene. That is how I got injury, sir. Now I realized that I should not tell lie about my husband. Husband only the great man, he gave a 25 acres of property. So I feel shy of a good things he has done. Then only I was able to understand what is the couplet he said, Inna Saidare Uruttal, Avar Nana Nanayam Siddhivadal. Then that gives a message to me, it is not you do it. Truth prevails ultimately. It is Bhagavan's grace. Bhagavan knows what is right, what is not right. Government decided to observe Bant in the Ranchi, Jorkan. At 10.30, I was sitting in the court. I was Chief Justice. Matter came. I just heard the matter. I gave the order, four lines order. It is reported that Bant is going to be observed by the government itself, by the cabinet decision. Most unfortunate and constitutional. I direct. The government should not observe Bant. If anything untoward thing happens, then all the chief minister, chief secretary, all the officials will be hauled up for contempt. So nothing, nothing happens against the order of situation.